Hey, what's up guys? All right, so me and Max, we're just out doing some socializing. Wait, uh, we're out here in Home Depot. Good job, pal. Um, basically, everything's going really well. Like, of course, he's obeying, obeying really well. Heel. Um, it's, as I'm getting him out in public, the first couple minutes of getting him anywhere are kind of a handful because he wants to fixate on everything around. He's kind of looking to protect and defend himself. Heel. So right there, a little bit. Oh, nope, heel. So what we're going to do right now is demand obedience near the thing he's afraid of. And then what's going to be important for you guys <clears throat> in the future. So this is just a guy like slamming down some shingles. And so it's not, it's not like super scary stress. Heel. Um, but basically what he what he seeks to do when when he gets out and gets stimulated or gets nervous is he either wants to go into fight or flight or he is seek, he seeks affection to get through it so we are out here with a couple other dogs um that's why there's no no danger of him reacting to him um if that was a dog i wouldn't know i would have been redirecting away from that so so the key is like controlled exposure. Good job, buddy. When we get him out in the stores and, and stuff like that, I want a loose leash and I want to take, and, and when you guys get him back, I want you to take your time getting him into the store because um, what happens before we enter, if we just charge in, then we kind of, we kind of do this in a hurried, adrenalized way. If I let him know like, we're not even going in until you give me heel, Good job. Until you give me good obedience, then uh, he'll. Then this obedience gives him something to focus on that doesn't make him doesn't make him nervous. So, so he can just be out here and just dealing with stuff. Max, down. Down. Good job, buddy. So he kind of has a tendency to want to down, down, down. He kind of wants to down, good job, right at your feet. And so, so when we get, when we get, um, it's kind of an appeasement behavior. So if dogs down at your feet, sometimes they're saying, well, ah, I kinda, I'm kind of needing something, I'm needing. And what, in, that in and of itself isn't horrible. Good job, buddy, heel. But it's kind of an indicator of what I would call like, good job, a codependent relationship. So when I get the dog out, um, I don't want him relying on me to get through stress. I want him to be able to process it on his own. So you can see this point is healing off leash. Again, he knows Jet. We're just doing walk bys, but um, proud of his progress. Um, I think he's coming a long way. And then we just keep keep doing this kind of stuff, and he gains confidence and and loses reactivity as, as we do this more and more.